Hey guys, welcome to a very different video for today. So for today, we're going to be talking about the new recent news that has come up for SML. Now for those who don't know, SML is basically a plush channel that makes parody videos using Nintendo plushies and to make like skits and jokes. Basically they're a parody channel and turns out they actually got a cease and desist by Nintendo. For those who don't know what that is, it's basically a warning that they will sue you. It's not them being sued. I've seen a ton of that being thrown around YouTube and social media. And it just shows to me how a lot of people actually don't know what a cease and desist is. And I get that. A lot of people don't know the copyright system as well as the actual government. I vaguely know it or understand it because I have to. You know, I'm a reaction channel. I obviously have to know what fair use is, what safe harbor is, you know, just a ton of copyright based terms and of course I know the difference between being sued and getting a cease and desist. Now I feel like a lot of the channels that I've seen making the videos I feel like they might have just not known the difference or they're just clickbaiting which also I wouldn't be surprised. So that's basically what it started with was a cease and desist and Nintendo basically stated that they couldn't use anything that related to Nintendo like for example they couldn't use character names in their channel name they couldn't use basically any character name in anything, for example, like channel URL, bio, like anything. And they also couldn't use Nintendo characters in their video, so, so that's why they've had to resort to the human puppets. And personally, my opinion on the human puppets is they're not that bad. Personally, I think the outlashing from the fans is just way too over the top, and personally, I think they need to grow up a little bit. But that's just my opinion on everybody's reaction to the whole them switching to human puppets. And honestly, in my opinion, I actually thought it wasn't that bad because, you know, it's the backup. Like, they had a backup. But now this is getting even worse. So, yeah, news has dropped that they now have to create new channels and delete their old channels, meaning that they have to literally delete the backlog of videos they've made for a life's worth supply of videos. So yeah, that's not great for them. Having a backlog of videos on this platform is completely necessary for you to actually succeed as a channel because you continue to grow with those videos from the past. And the fact that they have to delete all those videos is not really great for them. Not only that, they have to make newer channels and start completely fresh with a few help from, you know, the channels that are popular and haven't been deleted yet, but they eventually will, which makes sense that obviously you want to promote these channels so that way, you know, you actually could succeed and still succeed. So yeah, honestly, this has gotten definitely worse from when it started because it merely just started as a warning to literally now them deleting their entire channels. So, uh, yeah, that is very bad. Now with this video coming to a close, I'd like to say one thing, and that's don't harass Nintendo for this. They they have every right to claim for their characters because they own the rights to their characters. And also don't harass SML for this. I mean, this is clearly not their fault, so what is the point of even doing that? But yeah, these are mainly just my thoughts on what's been going on with this whole cease and desist thing from Nintendo. If you guys disagree with me, that's totally fine. Your opinions are valid. And if you agree with me, that's also totally fine. Of course, you can totally agree with me. <laughs> but yeah, what are your guys' thoughts on this whole situation? Make sure to leave that down in the comments down below. Make sure to leave a like if you want to see more content like this. Consider subscribing if you're new. It's free, helps out the channel, and you can unsubscribe whenever you want. But anyways, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!